Hey everyone, we're back with another video. Today we're looking at the uh, Onda V975W tablet and we're going to go ahead and line it up against the Surface 3. Um, this has the Bay Trail SoC and this has the Cherry Trail SoC. Obviously it's not really a fair fight. The Onda V975W has the low end um, Z3735D uh, Atom CPU uh, with, inch, with the Intel HD graphics, uh, it's generation 7 and it only has four execution units um, versus the Cherry Trail, this is a high-end version of the Cherry Trail it's the X7 uh, Z8700 uh, with the Intel HD graphics generation 8 uh, with 16 execution units so um, performance theoretically should be around 50 percent better um, if not more on the uh, on the Surface 3 so we're going to go ahead and run this uh, benchmark. I am going to be running it at, um, just going to pull it in here and just kind of show you. It's going to be running 720p. Everything's on low settings. The frame rate is unlocked. Uh, AA is disabled. So, pretty bare bones basic settings here. So, we'll be running both machines, both tablets, shall I say, um, the same fixed benchmark. In. All right, let's go ahead and start it up. So the Surface 3 got a head start there as far as loading times. Yeah, storage is, is uh, typically a little bit faster on this latest version of the EMC storage. So frame rates are pretty much double. Uh, a little bit more than double from what I'm seeing thus far. Now the uh, the Achilles heel of the Surface 3 is that it will throttle. Uh, it will throttle actually a lot faster than the Onda, uh, strictly because the Onda is actually this the uh, Z3735D has a TJ Max of actually 105 degrees Celsius, so um, it doesn't really throttle that much. However, it is TDP limited more so than the um, than the Cherry Trail SSC, but um, it just the Cherry Trail SSC just runs hot, CPU runs hot starts hitting that 84, 85 C range and it just starts to throttle um, down to its base clock. Alright, so let's look at the final results here. So the Surface 3 has an average frame rate of 41 frames per second. Um, this is the 4 gigabyte, uh, 4 gigabyte model with 120 gigs of eMMC storage. Um, and the Onda did 18.5 frames per second on average, so the difference is actually more than double. It's quite substantial, actually. So um, it's impressive um, on this game specifically, but um, we'll try out some more games and see if we can find some more fixed benchmarks to uh, do a comparison, but just wanted to upload this video. If anybody has any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Thanks.